Welcome to Journal of the Classes. In this supplemental series, we have been and will continue diving into each D&D class and their corresponding subclasses. This week's episode is... Wizard! wizard. It's so wizard. So wizard, I know. I don't know how to say that <laughs> and make it sound cool. <laughs> Whatever. All right, let's get All right. into it. Wizard. Learned mages of great power, wizards comb through the secrets of the multiverse and are supreme magic users, defined and united as a class by the spells they cast. Sound like anybody uh, familiar? Sound like anyone familiar? Hmm? Someone that might be a little strange and unusual? Blade singing. Weird start, but all right. A form of magic that integrates sword play and dance with the ability to manifest a spirit sword from their very souls. Blade singers are dangerous, yet seem on the surface to be quite the opposite. Hmm. Well, it's, yeah. So it's like, don't judge a blade by its singing? Huh? Order of the scribes! <laughs> Order of the scribes. <laughs> Forsaking magic for the academic pursuits of wizardry. That's like uh, anybody in Hogwarts. Okay. <laughs> Is a noble deed and one required to keep the study of magic alive. Ooh. I'm looking at you, Nicholas Flamel. <laughs> That's where the order of scribes comes in. Bookish and intelligent, the scribes record discoveries in magic and technology so future wizards may further their studies. If it's not in the archives, it simply does not exist. That's a quote by Jacosta New. Oh, we see oh. you, Jacosta New. <laughs> we see you. It exists. It exists. <laughs> Let's go talk to you about it. Let's go talk to you, right. So he can Lost berate a... us for losing Lost the planet. Lost a planet, Master Kenobi has. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's a bad year. That's a real bad year. <laughs> it, was, right. it was intentionally bad, but still. Abjuration. These wizards specialize in magic that blocks, banishes, or protects. Called abjurers. Members of this school are sought when baleful spirits require exorcism. When important locations must be guarded against magical scrying. And when portals to other planes of existence must be closed. The power of Cthulhu compels you! Conjuration. Ooh. Conjurers of otherworldly beings and travelers of the plains. These wizards can summon elementals to fight with them or banish demons back to the nine hells. Or as a hot date in a pit. See what you did there. It's good. Divination. Clairvoyance and fortune tellers, these wizards are highly sought after by the nobility to foretell the future and interpret signs from the divine. I mean, look, we, we, we already know the joke's not going to work, so why, why are we going to do it? I mean, yeah, they, let's they, just move on. Yeah. Anyway. Enchantment. <laughs> Charmers and seducers. Enchanters modify and manipulate the world to their liking, spreading peace or conflict wherever they tread. They're also great politicians. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And we could have gone a lot of places with that. Yeah, and that, we felt that like was the politicians safest. was the safest. It's the safest. Evocation. Evokers are masters of the elements and use this mastery to destroy mortal foes and to weaken immortal ones. And they know how to rave. <laughs> I need a whistle. <laughs> Illusion. <laughs> I'm illusion. Illusion. And this is glamour. <laughs> uh, illusionists are tricksters and magicians, confusing or hiding from threats while casting an ice knife into their target's back. <laughs> Don't believe everything you see or hear or anything. I mean, just just don't believe anything. Just <laughs> don't stop. Because you can't believe, so. <laughs> Necromancy. Exploring the cosmic forces of life, death, and undeath 
God's sakes. These fate-bound wizards can be great healers or evil masters of undead armies. I'll get you, He-Man! <laughs> and your little dog, too. <laughs> I mean, your battle cap, too. <laughs> your battle cap, too. <laughs> Transmutation. Ooh. Altering the very fabric of reality is common fare for these mages. To them, the world is not a fixed thing, but eminently mutable. And they delight in being an agent of change. So we really should cross out change and just say chaos. Uh, but their personalities are very rigid. Because, you know, all the chaos. Right. You, just, I mean, yeah, you gotta have kind of something. Or something yeah. there. War magic. Battle mages are formidable. Specializing in abjuration and evocation, they are geared for war and act as super weapons on the battlefields of petty wars or titanic struggles for the fate of the world. By the way, the password is a strongest adventure. <laughs> and that is wizard. So... You know what that was? That was wizard. There we go. That was wizard. I have been Shadu. I have been... Fay Frey! <laughs> And we will see you next time on Journal's Classes. Bye! Bye.